In 1899, all the cooks inside the bakery are busy with their work, and the owner is monitoring them all. He then calls the delivery boys, and asks which one is the fastest. Then calls a boy standing among them, and tells him that he must deliver this cake within 20 minutes. His name is Matvey, and he works as an ice skating courier boy. Matvey goes to deliver the parcel, but the way is blocked to make the rich pass first. And when Matvey tries to move forward, they stop and push him back. The rich man passes from there, and enters his big mansion. His name is Nikolai, and he has a beautiful daughter named Alice. She is holding a rabbit and talking to Miss Jackson. Nikolai meets with his second wife Severina, who is his stepmother of Alice. They all sit at the dining table, and Severina tells him about the New Year celebration, and they are invited. Nikolai talks about the new sanctuary and advancement. It seems that her father is forcing her to learn royal things and stuff like that. But she doesn't want to learn that, and is interested in education. Alice says that the new time has also brought education for women on. But her father says that the noble and respectable women don't need to go for an education. And when she talks about Queen Victoria, her father becomes angry about this, and says that she doesn't require any education. Matvey returns to the bakery after delivering the parcel. But the battery owner gives him the money and tells him that he is fired. And this is because he couldn't deliver food in the limited time. Matvey tells him about the troops who stopped him, but the owner doesn't ready to listen. And they throw him outside the shop. Matvey is so disappointed and he is scatting into the eyes slowly, but suddenly colliding with a man standing there. They both fall and he says sorry to him. But Matvey looks at the ground and notices that the man has dropped something on the floor. He picks it up and starts running behind him. Matvey is skating and running fast. He then approaches the man. The man says that he is so good at skating. And Matvey tells him he was a skating delivery boy, but he was fired. The man introduces himself as Alex, and offers him a job. Then asks Matvey to meet him tonight. After a while, Matvey goes to help his father in his work. But his father is coughing, and they both go home. His father sharps his skating shoes, which he gifted him, and says these are magical skates. In the mansion, Alice is hiding in her room. She has dissected a frog and has a mean interest in science. Meanwhile, Matvey gets a personal address at night, and goes to the address that Alex told him. He goes there and sees a gang. Alex tells him that they all are thieves and are stealing things from the noble landlord merchants. And they offer him to be a part of their gang because he is so good at skating. Then they go out for a run, where Matvey tells them all about the incident, and the reason why he is fired from the bakery, then tells them about the nobleman. They suggest to punish those, then they go toward the mansion. They jump the wall, and ask Matvey to steal something. When Matvey tries to steal, Alice sees them through the window. She comes out, and Matvey asks her not to scream. But the lamp falls from her hand, and Matvey's hand catches fire. He jumps down, and they all run from there. They manage to escape, and Matvey says goodbye to them. Then says that we will meet again, and he will think about being a part of their gang. The following day, Alice tells her maid about the last night's incident. Meanwhile, Severina tells Nikolai that their daughter is getting rude, and they should marry her. And Nikolai says that he will search for a perfect match for his daughter. He arranges a meeting on the state's current situation, where all the captains come. They talk about the pickpocket cases, which are increasing daily. And the last one was what happened to his daughter. One of them stands introduces the new types of weapons, and suggests that they should buy them. But a man called Captain Arcady, says there are better ways to manage the situation. He says, that thieves are using another strategy, and that they are stealing things by using ice skates. And if they want to stop the pickpocket cases, they should practice the ice skates. The next day, Matvey goes to the market, where he meets Alex and his gang. He tells them that he is ready to join their gang, and they become happy about this. Alex asks him to learn all the tricks for stealing. Then he starts training in the market, and shows him the best and easy tricks. Matvey tells his father that he has another job, and his father becomes happy. Meanwhile, Captain Arcadi brings his mother to the event. They meet Nikolai and Alice, and Arcadi looks interested in Alice during the whole event. At the end of the event, he gives the invitation card to Nikolai, and says there is a skating club event, then he invites him and Alice to come. Nikolai says that he will go if he has time for it. The next day, 
Matt Bay takes his father to the doctor, but tells him his father has advanced tuberculosis, and says that only one doctor in Germany can treat him, which is costly for them. After a while, Matt Bay goes to Alex. Then the team go to the market, and steal things from people. They work the whole day nicely, and at night they go to the secret hideout of Alex, which they call Old Leaky. It seems it is a broken old ship, then they all go inside, and divide everything they have stolen. Between those things, they find an invitation card for the skating club event. Alex and Matt Vey go there, and they are wearing expensive clothes, so no one can notice them, because only the elite class is invited to the event. They then go inside to steal, and they stole a lot of expensive things from the guests. Alice is here, and Arkady is also here with his mother. He comes forward and starts skating, then he impresses Alice and asks her to dance. She goes with him, and he tells her that he loved her at first sight, and is imagining his life with her. But the event owner comes to him and says that the situation is dire, and they have thieves present in this event. Meanwhile, Matt Vey collides with Alice mistakenly. She recognizes him and says you were on my balcony that day. Alice tells him she won't tell anybody, but she will make a deal with him. She tells him an address, and asks him to meet her tomorrow. Then Alex takes Matt Bay with him, because the people are now searching for the thieves. They both run away from there, and the ice gang is partying at the club. When Matt Bay comes home, he is drunk and gives his father so much money. But his father becomes suspicious and asks him, from where did he get this money? Orders him to give this money back from where it came. But Matt Vey replies, that they both need money for his treatment. And it doesn't matter from where this money came, but his father becomes angry and says that God is listening. Matt Vey says there is no God. But his father slaps him, and asks Matt Vey to go from home. He then starts living with Alex and his team. After a while, Arkady is preparing a team to fight those skating thieves. And he is giving them training. Nikolai comes there and he gives Arkady a briefing about the training. The next day, Matt Vey goes to the address which Alice told him. When he reaches here, he finds that it is a chemistry school, and she asks him to pretend like her husband. When she goes inside, she gives a chemical equation to the teachers. But when they ask for the signature of his husband, Matt Vey can't do this, and they answer the questions differently. Meanwhile, Alice becomes angry and goes out. She tells him that his father will never allow her for an education, that's why she requested him to come here. But when she is going from there, she gives her earrings to him, and says that this is the payment of your time. But Matt Vey runs behind her ride, and sits with her. He tells her that he is so poor, that's why he became a thief. And he wasn't doing this for money. But he is interested in her, then he asks her to meet him tonight. She says that she will meet him, but on another day, then he goes from there. On Christmas night, Nikolai gifts a beautiful necklace to his wife, and a necklace to his daughter too. Then Severina takes them out of the room to surprise them. She surprises her husband with a mobile, and they both go out for the Christmas celebration on that ride, but Alice stays at the mansion. When she is standing on the balcony, Matt Vey arrives there. He throws a rope toward her, and asks her to come to see the city on Christmas Eve. She accepts to go with him. He offers to go skating with him, and she says she doesn't know anything about skating. But he says he will help her with this. Then they both start skating. She becomes so happy seeing the Christmas celebration, and going among the people, to celebrate the new year too. She enjoys this, because she has never been out of the mansion. They both meet Alex there, and takes them both to a party. She sits with the gang, and talks to one of them on different matters. But suddenly he reacts rudely to her. Matt Vey becomes angry and fights with him. Then Alex stops them, and Matt Vey take Alice to her home. When they reach there, Alice says that she wishes this night never ends, and tells him that her parents are planning for her marriage, and asks him to go now. The next day, the gang members are again in the market to steal. But there is a planning from Arkady today, and he has sent his skating team to their market. Alex becomes aware of it, and he warns his members to go home. But one still tries to steal something, and gets trapped. Suddenly, Matt Vey saves him, and both start running away from them. The team Arkady is chasing them, but they somehow escape from there. And they get separated. But suddenly Arkady arrives near Matt Vey, and tries to catch him. They both start fighting each other but Arkady is so strong and active. He uses excellent techniques to catch him, and Alex comes there. And he shoots Arkady's leg, when he is about to catch him, then they run from there. After a while, Arkady goes to Alice, 
and tries to convince her to marry him. He says that he is a liberal, and has the same mindset like her. They also think women should get higher education, and they left for Severina's magic show. The magician shows unusual traits and puts his hand in the fire. But Alice goes forward and puts her hand in the fire. She explains that this is called a cold fire, and explains the chemical phenomena behind it. And due to this, her father becomes angry. After a while, Nikolai goes into her room. But he sees her books and becomes so angry. Then he calls the maid to collect all the books and put them on fire. On the other hand, Matvey's father becomes very sick. And he has died. Matvey goes to his grave and remembers the movements of his childhood when his father taught him skating and gave him those magical silver skates. He promises his dad that he will never steal again. Meanwhile, Alice is standing in her room and is crying meanly when Miss Jackson comes in. She consoles Alice and says she must do what she wants and not pay attention to others. After a while, the gang is again dividing the things they have stolen. Matvey says he doesn't want anything, because he has made a promise to his father. Meanwhile, Alice is trying to escape from home. She rides in her father's van and runs from there. All the employees start shouting, upon seeing this. She goes to the bar to see Matvey. And a girl there takes her to the ship of Alex, where Matvey is present. She gives money to him for his father's treatment and he starts crying. Then he tells her that his father passed away. Alice tells him that she has left home and is going to Paris to get an education at the best chemistry school there. Matvey then takes her upstairs to the room and says good night. But before she goes, she says she loves him. Suddenly, Arkady arrives there with his troops, and he announces from the outside, that if they all won't come out, he will put the ship into the fire. After some time, he puts the boat into the fire, and all the gang members start running in hurry. Some come out, and are caught by the troop. Alex holds a gun, while Matvey accompanies Alice and ties her with a rope. He then asks her to jump down, but she says that he should have to come with him. Alex comes there and pushes Matvey down. He then puts the gun on Alice, and shouts to make Arkady attentive to him. Alex says that if they don't leave his fellows, he will kill Alice. Arkady leaves the gang, and asks Alex to leave her. But the rope is burning, and she is about to fall. Matvey comes forward and holds the rope, and saves her. Arkady then catches Alice from below, and takes her away. She is crying for Matvey, but no one is listening to her. And he takes Alice away. On the other hand, Matvey goes toward Alex. And he asks Matvey to jump down in the water. Matvey says he should jump with him, but Alex says the captain always jumps at the end. He jumps in the water, but when Alex is about to jump, the troops fire on him. And he falls into the water. He is killed, and Matvey looks at him hopelessly. And when Matvey comes out from the water, some people gather there. Then they take him to the doctor, because they all think he must be a fisherman. The doctor treats him, and when he opens his eyes, he remembers his father. The doctor then gives him his money. On the other hand, Arkady takes Alice to her home, and her father accepts Captain Arkady to marry her. After a while, it's her wedding day, and she looks so hopeless. Matvey comes there, and gets up, like a waiter serving the people. When Alice comes to the event with Arkady, she seems unwell, and asks him to leave her for some time. She goes to a side, and starts looking in the mirror. But suddenly, Matvey comes there, and Alice becomes surprised to see him. He puts out two tickets from his bucket, and says that these are the tickets to Paris, and they can still go to Paris together. Then they both decided to run away from there, and climbed the wall of the mansion. But they mistakenly dropped one of the tickets on the stairs. Meanwhile, Arkady is searching for her. He looks at the stairs, and finds the ticket. Arkady takes his horse, and goes after them. They both reach the station. And when they are about to sit on the train, they come to know that one ticket is missing. Arkady reaches there holding that ticket, and Matvey starts fighting with him. But in the end, Matvey becomes successful in snatching the ticket. He takes the ticket and runs toward the train. Matvey catches the train. And when he is about to get in, Arkady fires on him. But they both become surprised to see that bullet hasn't touched him because of the silver skates of his father. Then they both go to Paris. After four years, Nikolai comes to Paris and asks about his daughter. They tell him that she is about to complete her degree after one year and that she is one of the best lecturers in chemistry. Then he goes into a classroom secretly where she is teaching the student. He looks at her for some time, and then she notices her father and becomes happy about this. They both are skating with her son Peter, 
and are very happy together. Then she looks at Peter, and says he is too good at skating, like his father. Thanks for watching, take care, and see you in the next video. Back in my bag and I gotta brag, I do this shit for real. When we was down and we had nothing, we had to share a meal. We put the shit in overdrive.